Hi, I'm Jordan Cook, and today we're going to be talking about the Alpha Laval V70 ThinkTop. We'll talk about normal operation, error codes, and resolving those error codes. So let's talk about the normal operations of an Alpha Laval V70 ThinkTop. The ThinkTop is a control and indication device, meaning it receives a signal controlling the valve position, and it indicates back to a control system exactly what the valve position is. Let's dig into that a little bit more. In addition to communicating the valve position with the control system, it also has a visual indicator, this ring of lights around the top. In its de-energized or normal position, you'll see a green light here. In the case of this mix-proof valve, that means the valve is closed. When the light is white, that means the valve is in an energized position. And in the case of this mix-proof valve, that means the valve is in its fully open position, allowing flow between the upper and lower body. For valves fitted with upper seat lift surveillance, like this one, when the light is blue, that indicates that the valve is in the upper seat lift position. When the light is yellow, that indicates that the valve is in the lower seat push position. Any parts or equipment shown or discussed in this video can be found at csistore.com. Let's talk about failure modes. Anytime you see a red flashing light, like right now, the ThinkTop is trying to communicate to you that there is a failure. To get more details about that failure, we need to get inside the ThinkTop. To remove the cap, simply turn it counterclockwise, pull it straight up. On the front of the control board, there will be some illuminated lights, which will communicate to you what the error description is. The light with the number 16 next to it will always be illuminated. The other lights will vary based on what error you're experiencing. In this example, 16, four, and one are illuminated. That means our error description is 21. In the manual, you can find that error code 21 means an unexpected process valve movement has occurred. You can also see recommendations for resolution. If you're having trouble resolving one of these errors, take a picture of the control board, including all the relevant lights, send it to CSI with a brief description of the problem, and one of our valve experts can work you through the problem and get your process back up and running. So those are the basics of a mixproof valve. Thanks for watching this brief explanation video, and make sure to reach out to a CSI valve expert if you have any more questions or need any more details.